This uh, fire took place in a town called Ramansky. It's about 100 kilometers north of Moscow, a small town, and it took place in a psychiatric hospital, which was basically a wooden building. The fire started about 2 o'clock in the morning. It could have been either an electrical short circuit or possibly arson, according to investigators, but I think they're focusing on an electrical fire. The building has almost completely burned down. And because it's a psychiatric hospital, there were bars on many of the windows. Some patients died trying to escape. Others had been sedated because of their illnesses and uh, died in their beds. So far, as far as we can tell, only one nurse has survived and two patients that she led to safety. The other 38 people in the building were all believed to have died. The nearest fire station was 50 kilometres away and the fire engine had to take a large detour to get to the town because the ferry, which normally operates in the summer, uh, hasn't yet opened for the summer in winter. The, the ferry doesn't operate. But it all sounds terribly uh, uh, unsatisfactory, Daniel. A wooden building, an old wooden building, uh, not very good um, fire precautions put in place, and then, as you were saying, uh, the fire brigade having to make a, a great roundabout journey before getting there. Yes, uh, Russia is a, is a nation of, of two pictures, really. There are some, of course, very modern hospitals in some of the bit larger cities, and some very modern fire regulations operate in some of the larger cities. But when you get out of the big cities into these smaller settlements, uh, things operate very differently. The buildings are old. Uh, they're poorly maintained. The fire regulations very often aren't uh, taken particularly seriously. Uh, and it's expensive in such a large country to have fire stations everywhere, so sometimes the fire services are very far away and uh, you've got a combination of events uh, where with the bars on the windows, the sedation of the patients, the wooden building uh, and what appears to have been poor uh, care for the electrical circuits has obviously resulted in a terrible tragedy.